and we are off. It'll be Kane State to start this LEC semifinal under the lights here at Dr. Ron Butcher Field. Far side of the field, all Zawar. Now it's Vigo for Westcon. In arena on the far side, plays one on the ground, and Reagan Rasica gets his first action of today's game. Our ball's played to Norales behind him. Norales into the box for Westcon, has a shot saved and collect. Out of bounds for a corner kick, Russo. Towards the front post, a couple of bounces, cleared. I know, trying to defend for Keen can't. Still Talo, Talo shot, blocked. Looking for any type of space. Inorino into the box. Inorino still has it, now he's taken down and the penalty he's given. Sophomore leads and goals with 10. Shot comes in and it's a goal. Western Connecticut leads early. Caden Tallo adds another one. Eight down, plays one in. Towards the middle of the box, Hamzic goes up. Slapped down by Benson. Stowal Amon tries to shoot it on net. Brandon Komari's shot is blocked. Eight down goes by, Sinopoli steps up to it. Just got too much of it, pushes it over the crossbar. Lays it towards the top of the box. One down, Vigo shot just past the post. With intercepting the ball from the Owls. Excuse me, as Declan Coughlin goes into the box. Take it down, and the post he's awarded for Keene State. Excuse me, Jake, I'm sorry to cut you off, but the action You're good. said otherwise as Declan Coughlin comes into the box and taken down by a couple of Western Connecticut players. This is Coughlin, the fifth year. Puts it in for Keene, and this game is tied. Declan Coughlin puts his second goal in, and momentum comes back for the Keene State Owls. He makes it look easy out there with those kicks. Yes, very patient. I love the approach. Came on to the ball. Very poised, waited for Benson to make his move and then found the bottom right hand corner. Benson is still giving an ear fill this time to the assistant referee. Sinopoli plays it in. Towards the middle of the box, headed down. Shot, it's going to be wide, goal kick coming. Russo with the right this time plays it in. Rasica comes out, blocked on the goal line. What a play by the Owls defensively. Plays in the free kick. Headed up in the air towards the back post. Shot comes in. Wow, what a save. Ali Ozawa heads it over the crossbar. Oh my goodness. It was a great shot from the left foot of Ian Mounts. Rasica could not get to it. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, Ali Ozawa heads it over the crossbar. West Con. Threatening good block by Hamzic in the second yellow. Nonetheless, shot comes in and it's a good one. Had some power behind it, but just trailed past the post. Kick. The ball's played in. Seven, six, headed. Five, four, three. Ball's played two, in. Hamzic heads it up in the air. The ball will fall safely. Halftime, Tuesday one, Western Connecticut one. That'll do it for first half action here from Dr. Ron Butcherfield. That's construct first from the penalty spot. And then about 20 minutes later, he just can't stay behind their own penalty. And that's where the first half will end. Sinopoli has some space. Now we'll take a shot with the left foot. Oof. A good effort there from Giacomo Sinopoli. Could not find the target, however. To a better start this half than the last half. Obviously, no team has scored yet, so still tied 1 1. But I think both teams are just playing more aggressive on the ball. Left foot across comes in. Headed towards the net, and it's in. Western Connecticut up 2 1 now. That's the head of Caden Tallow, his second of this one. Mentioned coming in, the leading scorer in the regular season for the Wolves now has his second of the game. Still Alamon has it now for Keane, plays Sinopoli. It's 
Sinopoli can't go by Gustavo Medina. Deflect the ball comes into the box. Sinopoli wins it down. Correa's there. Offsides is the call. That does go against Sinopoli here. Excuse me, the drop ball was played, so. Not too sure what the call was. Aral is into the box for Western Canada. Connecticut. Connecticut hits a call again. The freshman Jeffrey Norales. He show to Coughlin. Keeps it in. Ball towards the front post. Nobody gets ahead on it. Eight down. We'll have one from distance. Nothing to worry about if you're Zachary Benson. Or all them on. Plays it down the near sideline. Chambers gets on the end of it, working against Gustavo Medina. Played in towards the front post. Correa wants that one back. Due for Western in the box. Tupa's ball comes in. Benson is there to catch. Plays it to the far side for Coughlin. Coughlin in the box trying to make his move. Coughlin still has it in a good defensive play and a quarter kick coming. And so that'll do it from the campus of Keats State College. The final score is 3-1 in favor of Western Connecticut. Western Connecticut will go on to face UMass Boston for a LEC Finals rematch. That will be on Saturday. Best of luck to both teams. Make sure to join us back in a few minutes for an interview with Coach Matt Schmidt.